How do you think he did with the dispute with Warren tonight? And they handled it just fine. Do you think that CNN threw a softball for Warren, <laughs> that it was a little too easy for her? Because the moderator seemed to suggest that she was correct in her version of events, even after he said... The framing of the question was definitely one-sided. It shouldn't have been framed that way. The question should have been asked, Senator, did you say this? And let him answer. And then you say the same thing to Senator Warren. He said he didn't say it, did he say it? But instead, they framed it as if it was an absolute. And that's wrong. Why do you think it would have been that? wrong? I don't know why they did it, but it was wrong. The senator, ludicrous, he didn't say it. He would never say it. He's been championing women's issues for a very long time. We know that Congresswoman Tulsi Gabbard put out in her tweet that she had a one-on-one -on -one meeting with the senator as well, and he was nothing but encouraging. So it's not true. He did not say it, and it's unfortunate the way they framed the question. Do you think CNN is playing sides here, that they're trying to hurt Bernie? Well, help you have to ask CNN that. The bottom line is that all of the candidates should be treated the same, ask the questions in a very fair way, and let the, let the uh, candidates respond. During the debate, uh, Kevin McCarthy of the GOP tweeted that Nancy Pelosi was trying to rig the Iowa caucus for Biden because Bernie is going to have to be at the impeachment trial, Elizabeth Warren. I don't so believe that. And, uh, I don't believe they Republicans need to stay out of that and handle, they pres handle the president and let the Democrats handle the Democrats. Do you think there's any of that going on in the Democratic? <laughs> Republicans should stay out of it and let the Democrats handle the Democrats this is in the primary. Possibly a choice Republicans would face. I mean, we've just been hearing from but the Warren. Republican campaign. leadership that plays politics all the time. I don't believe that the speaker is doing it that way. All of those senators up there took oath of office. They got to be there for the trial. Let's just let it happen. We're going to continue to campaign. The beautiful thing about the Sanders campaign is he has national co-chair like myself and other national co-chairs and national surrogates. We've been out there the whole time. So nothing really changes for our campaign. We're going to keep staying out there, getting the senator's message out. He is doing a fantastic job. He showed tonight who is going to really stand up for the worker day people of this nation, who has been the most consistent and who has had the most courage, and that is Senator Bernard Sanders.